Welcome to the Fall 2021 D2K Showcase. We are super excited to have you here in person, finally, after so much time. Um, it's great to see all of your faces and enthusiasm for data science. The Rice D2K Lab's mission was to promote interdisciplinary and immersive data science education by giving students opportunities to work on real world challenges during their time at Rice and also to help partners solve their challenges in data science and machine learning by partnering with us on student projects and student teams. The D2K Showcase is an amazing opportunity to get to highlight all of the work that we've done this semester and really all of the learning and the growth and effort that we've put into developing this model. I think it really highlights how applicable data science is and why it's growing so vastly and uh, rapidly as a field. Our project is like detecting recurrent stroke in patients who have already had one stroke and one of the approaches that our sponsors at UTL have tried to, to solve other problems with is an approach that's using graph theory and that's actually one of the research areas that me and a couple other members of the team have worked in prior so this project so far has been like a really great way for me to like use that use that research knowledge I've built, built and apply it to a problem that will really, that'll really help a lot, of, a lot of medical patients in the medical center. The winner, Esteem Audubon. <laughs> we had this great imagery, we had a new tool. Unfortunately, it was gonna take us a lot of time to now like, okay, does this, is this really a useful tool? So we've met weekly and we've cracked this problem. So we can take what took us three weeks to count all of these birds, not just to say bird versus trash, which is pretty darn good, but also to say it's not trash, it's a bird, and it's this bird because we've trained it with all of these annotated data going into this algorithm. It's a really neat tool. We're gonna continue it into the next semester, and um, you know, fingers crossed, we're gonna write a paper, We'll, we'll get it out to the rest of the world and we'll have a tool that can help conservation biologists the world over. It was, it was super exciting for me, um, you know, going from just learning about things in classes, kind of how these computer visual al vision algorithms work, but taking it to a new level of actually applying it to the real world. So uh, huge props to Arco and Ginevra and everybody else who've, who've made this capstone class because I personally have learned a lot through the experience of actually running these algorithms and using it on real, real world data.